okay okay I am going to start then and here is what we will do uh, I know everybody is very cozy and saving chairs for friends but um, we will start here and then we'll go walk around so um, we, um, I place different pictures around and we'll spend a little bit of time in each location and then move on because it's a beautiful island and it's a nice day for walking. So um, my name is Maria Drushkova, Maria D. Hubs in Second Life, and I am director of Natural Math. So uh, Natural Math is a company uh, that um, does curriculum development and education consulting. We do courses online for parents and teachers. I think we were the first ever people in the world to offer a mathematics course for parents specifically. So parents can do mathematics with their children. And I um, like to work, I like to work on um, gatherings called mathematical circles. So mine are usually adventures with young kids like calculus for five-year-olds. Uh, we organize a lot of events like this one online and also face-to-face -face events in physical space. And uh, we do um, different things, whatever it takes to help a community develop. So I am going to talk today about mathematical circles, mathematical circles as an example of how a community does its own research on itself, so to speak. And then um, this will be an extended example of how we crowdsource what a community wants, basically find out what a group of people want. And then um, I'll introduce another example of citizen science we do at Natural Math. Now, I would like everyone to ask questions at the any time. I do keep an eye on the chat. Mm, and I, I will also stop specifically for questions quite a few times because I, I want it to be your active involvement in it. So, okay, mathematical circles first. Um, I want to, I want people to let me know in chat if they have heard the word mass circle or mathematical circle before. Has anyone heard of it? Has anyone participated? Yes, yes. Okay, a couple of people had. Um, no, okay. I will, heard of, mm hmm yeah. Okay, uh, no, so I will define a mathematical circle and I really like the definition on Wikipedia and one part is because I helped to write it. So we uh, have a good group of people uh, to edit that Wikipedia article and I kind of took a lead and, lead and interviewed different people on that uh, collected ideas. So here is the definition. I'm just going to read it because I'm so fond of it fond of it. Okay, a mass circle is a social structure where participants engage in the depths and intricacies of mathematical thinking, propagate the culture of doing mathematics, and create knowledge. So it's a social structure, so there, uh, it's very vague because there are small groups of people doing it in their houses. There are giant groups gathering at universities. There are online mathematical circles, like the science circle here is online, and so on. So the formats are really different. So um, then mathematical circles are defined by what they do. So uh, participants partake in problem solving, mathematical modeling, the practice of art and philosophical discourse. So a lot of people think that mathematicians count and mathematics is about numbers. So uh, a lot